Hey everybody, what's up? This is Haas. We are moving some chickens today. So I wanted to show you the easiest way to where you don't feel like Rocky running around trying to catch these things. But we're pulling it right from another movie as well. So instead of, uh, you know, getting winded and it's too hot out here anyway to be chasing chickens, we went to more of a horror and we went to Mommy Dearest. So we have a wire hanger here. I just stretched it out. You leave a little bit of a shepherd's hook here. And then you have your handle over here. And you're able to just walk up behind the rooster, snatch it in that. Its leg will get caught. It doesn't hurt the rooster or anything. Its leg will get caught. You can slide your hand down, grab it, pick it up, calm it down, and move it. We're getting rid of three of our roosters. That's we don't need this many roosters for as small of a flock that we have. It's going to um, someone who is starting out on their farm. Uh, they already have a couple hens. They want some roosters so they can start to um, hatch chickens and sell them. And they they're uh, just got some goats. They're they're starting a lot. And I'm going to support any young person that wants to um, start doing this. So Hannah's actually going to have to tell me because she's out here more with the chickens than I am. I one right over there. And so let's go ahead. Well, this one, I may not even need this. Let's see. He'll run from you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These stupid chickens. See how easy that was? Oh yeah, 10 minutes later. So what we found out the last one, I had this sprayed too wide, spread too wide. So I made it smaller and then bent this part out a little bit. Dummy. Probably thought you weren't gonna catch him. I know, I know. You're okay. You're okay. You're well, all he's right. He's got those head feathers up. Yeah. Chill. Oh, he's. So, got that one easy. Watch yeah. Out. Yeah, get that out of your system. So there we are. Once I realized that gap was too big, I got them very quick. It's very painless for the birds. No issues. They're a little shocked that all of a sudden they're upside down, but we have just a little bit of time left before we leave, but I wanted to get them in here. Um, so I'm gonna go grab a certain product that is going to keep them cool that you'll see in a couple uh, days when I post that product review. So y'all be self-sufficient, help everyone you can, inconvenience no one. You have a good day. Bye.